Hello and welcome back. Thanks for joining me onto this journey. Today we will be touching on my distant brothers, the Poles. Uh, not literally, of course, <laughs> this is a family friendly channel. The Polish guys, of course, uh, being famous for their winged hussars and very infamous in the League of Legends community. Uh, but we do not judge here on this channel, uh, only slightly. So <laughs> let's get to the slight judging of my brothers right here. Let's start a single player game, skirmish and let's go now i have to admit i've already tried the polls because i was curious on if i can understand them or not and i gotta admit yes so <laughs> i will be tempted to uh repeat some of the words that they're saying and i would like to take this opportunity and say sorry to any polish people watching because i'm probably going to be butchering your language a bit uh, <laughs> Now, we're having a situation here. These guys, well, I am not a fan of that. But, uh, yeah, let's move you all in here. I have a theory. Since uh, this building we have here, uh, Fallwark, is instead of a mill. And it brings some extra bonuses. I think uh, the food that you're collecting around it gets collected faster. Uh, hopefully, that also means the sheep and the goats. If it does, then great, we just made a, a big improvement to our economy. If it doesn't, then, well, that's for the science. We are starting in a feudal age. This is Empire Wars, of course, because I just wanted to showcase the Poles, just as I did the Czechs, or the Bohemians, rather. Uh, one improvement that we were going to do though, is that I am going to build a wonder if the circumstances allow it. Of course we can get completely smashed, which would not be ideal, but uh, that is of course the op- uh. Hmm, now th is, this, is this a smart investment? How much does this sound? Uh, 125, well that's quite a lot, but I also do not- do not want to carry it all here. Uh, of course, there is the option to take the scout and, you know, uh, drag them to my center or to the full work. But we're not going to be doing that because we're just chilling today. We need to find the enemy, to slap him as much as we can. All right. Um, another thing that I can do, if I'm going to be building uh, mills, it's probably a good idea to build it around the uh, around the fall work since uh, it has some bonuses for farms exactly. I think what it says is, let me read it. Immediately collects 10% of food from nearby newly constructed farms. So if we construct the farm, then we should get. Let's see. And shoop. Yeah, I don't know. I did not actually notice. And the only thing that this did is that I have. Uh, a lot of <laughs> unused villages. So one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, you guys here. We need, we need some wood. All right, going perfect here. We have plenty of points. We have everything the heart could desire. Now we're gonna use you, good sir, to build a market so we can advance to another level level I mean of course uh, age right looking good looking great I am hmm, yeah I am gonna be wanting to build a dock here just so we get some extra economy going on and let's discuss the battle plan Poles being an cavalry civilization uh, they are pushed towards the light cavalry line with the winged hussar, which is a, a special unit. Uh, but then at the same time, they have a unique u technology that gives, <laughs> gives their knights 60% discount on the gold cost. And that's, uh, that's insane. I'm not sure if they get uh, paladins. If they do, then... Yeah, there needs to be some drawback that <laughs> I haven't found yet, but um, that's incredibly strong. Another strong part of them 
is of course the uh, let me go for this the winged hussar line uh, even more supported with the mm -mm -mm, Lechitit Legacy and this is the, probably the first uh, word that I butchered. Light Cavalry deals trample damage. So whatever they attack is gonna be split into nearby units. Very, very strong. I'm curious on how all that is gonna go. So let's just check in here. Uh, is it just me or am I missing something here? Wasn't, wasn't there supposed to be something? <laughs> Let's, let's check in this. Mm. Yeah, they're missing. They're missing a plate, uh, boarding armor. All right. Also, their uh, cavalry definitely has some disadvantages to this, but I think the advantages are still much more than than the disadvantages are. But uh, what I would like to showcase, of course, I'm gonna go through the uh, hussars because yeah. Can't really, <laughs> can't really skip that, but I would like to go build a castle and build a unique unit from there because they have some interesting, interesting uh, mechanic there. Right now, what we're gonna need is yep, a lot of food. We're gonna need to build a quick castle afterwards as well. I think I'll boom a bit. I'm glad I built the dock. Great, using it a bit at least. It's gonna come in handy. Okay, yeah, looking good. So, you guys are gonna be tasked with building a town center. And I think you boys are gonna be tasked with one as well. Now, what do we expect from the opponent? Uh, he is the Bohemians, which means probably a lot of siege. From my experience, uh, good way to deal with the vagans that uh, the bohemians build is uh, mango nails. Yeah. I'm not sure why you're building stables because that is literally the worst thing <laughs> you can do as bohemians. But, uh, well, it's uh, his loss, so I'm not gonna be fighting him on that. Just build it if you need to, my man. Uh, yeah, but we're probably gonna be expecting some infantry uh, to counter my horses and a lot of siege. Uh, Hofnice and the Hussite wagons. So let's just prepare. Actually, no. You guys, you guys are gonna stay there. You're gonna mine me a lot of stone. We're gonna get the stone mining upgrade as well. Uh, I'm not sure, we do not need that, that's a farming upgrade more than anything else. And yeah, let's get ready. Uh, I'm thinking we're first gonna hit him with the, with the cavalry. We're gonna go for the fourth age, build a bunch of hussars, raid him a bit, and then I'm gonna showcase the, the castle with the amazing armor shredding unit <laughs> if you don't know what that means just just you wait it's coming mm, yep well meanwhile um, uh, that I'm collecting this resources I think I'm just gonna build monastery and I'm gonna build this one as well yep let's get ready with all of these guys uh, two more. Ah, one more. All right. Okay, okay. I'm looking fine. Getting ready to jump into the next age again. Now, I am a bit worried about the score here. Something very bad might happen very soon. <laughs> so, let's just keep a lookout. I'm confident we can we can handle this though. Alright, no, no, no. Here you go, here. So, and let's advance to the next age. Now, Hussars, of course, don't need any gold. So, we'll be focusing our economy on to food at the moment. Uh, one, two, three, 
four, five. But I'm gonna fit this bad boy in there, so it so the food gets boosted and build some more around it. Ah, excuse me for a second. <laughs> Okay, we're back. So, uh, anything I'm forgetting? Probably not. Fast food, great. We got an achievement. <laughs> and we're gonna build a forward castle. Now, I'm not that big of a fan of this castle in particular. Uh, kinda reminds me of the Incas. Uh, Incas uh, Wonder. Uh, but, you know, it's what it is. Not an ugly, ugly one either. I just prefer the bohemian one. Right, uh, I think we can prepare some uh, light cavalry already. Now, I would not really suggest starting with light cavalry as an opening, because they are not the strongest. Uh, probably what you want to do in the game is just open with knights, since uh, they can handle anything thrown at them much better. But, uh, you know, of course, today we're just showcasing what's happening around. And we are not try-harding this. Roskazania? Pravilna. Right. Well, that was more Russian than anything. Jestem <laughs> Okay, sorry for that. I, I do not know if I should attempt that again. <laughs> Jestem Spraviaczko. That's that it is. Alright. Well, uh, we have our castle here. Oh, no, no, no. We are not upgraded yet. We, we need the winged hussars. Now that I'm thinking about it, we should have probably made this uh, Ottomans Turks against the winged hussars to reenact the, <laughs> the famous battle. Uh, but, well. We are slapping the, the checks anyway. Kind of hurting my own nationality here, but <laughs> what can you do? Uh, a bit more upgrades. Yeah, great. Great, we do not want to fight at the moment. We did some great damage to this guy. And we don't need to push it too far. I'm gonna need to make some more farms. One, two, three, four. Five, six, great. Now I don't, I don't really know how far does this this thing reach. Two, three, four, five, six. So we're just going to be making a few of these. It's not that big of an investment anyway. It's just, uh, oh, go. Yeah, it's just 125 wood. All right, looking fine here. Actually, that is not looking fine. Where is my cavalry? This is the only winged hussar I have left, and that's what I was talking about. <laughs> uh, if you open with hussars, you're getting some bad, bad units at the beginning, and this, these are not even that good. It's bo bohemian uh, knights. These guys are trash, and I'm getting slapped. So let's just get some more units, get some more upgrades, get some more food. Perfect. And here we go, these bad boys. Yeah, looking great. Still, you can still tell that it is a hussar, just a better one. Right, uh, I'm probably gonna want to start uh, and defend this this castle. We're gonna need to make the obuch. Right, uh, but not yet. We need a bit of a mass. And also, I'm gonna send you guys here. Prepare for the for the wonder drop. And this one, light cavalry deals trample damage. Once we have that one, I think we're ready to go. Ready to slap some asses. Again, uh, sorry, family friendly channel. Don't get too excited. Nothing graphic is gonna happen here. And one, two, three, four. Five. There. Right. Perfect. You go here. Help. Uh, and house, of course. What else would it be? 
Now I see that these guys already took care of the army that the other guy had. Uh, we're just gonna be taking care of the houses for a bit and go and look into his economy. That's kind of what you expect from the Hussars to do anyway. And this is the problem. <laughs> Bohemians, very well known for the halberdiers and for the Karlstein, the, the castle. Uh, and the spear line dealing 25% more damage. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, 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 that one is gonna hurt. So, uh, not the best showcase of the winged hussars. This is not what the, <laughs> what the Magyars uh, in Budapest wanted to see. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, well, you know, in Age of Empires we have a bit of a different idea of what these guys should do. So we just split them around, go kill some villagers, make mess, and meanwhile we make our oy, 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 oy. we make our proper army here. We make some of the obuchs, which should probably, hopefully, counter these guys much better than the, the cavalry does. I mean the cavalry is doing great job just disrupting the economy here. He can't really focus on uh, farming. But that's not what's going to win us the game. What's going to win us the game is these bad boys, the Obuchs. And probably some siege as well. Now thinking about it, I'm going to build another castle because this is taking too long to create. Alright, you guys go back. And now, now I'm going to make a demonstration of what these guys are actually capable of doing. Uh, hopefully, well, just just murder that guy. <laughs> Let me see how you guys look. Very fancy, very nice hammer. Uh, and so watch this guy and his armor. One slap. Well, that's all that. <laughs> that's all that that guy did. But as you can see, every time that they attack, uh, the armor gets lowered. So, the longer you can keep these guys attacking, the more damage they're gonna do. Which, yeah, uh, <laughs> I can get behind that. They are shredding the spears. I'm a bit worried about the elite Hussite wagon. Uh, so, maybe we should stop sending them one by one and kind of make a combination here. Because the Hussar, Hussars are very good against the wagon. Uh, but these these guys are not uh, Elite Ombuch Before they get in they get just slammed by the Hasside Pagans So we're gonna make a bit of a bit of a mix And that should do the trick And meanwhile Yeah this one And meanwhile we are gonna showcase one last thing I wanna see I wanna show And it's this one Ooh See now I actually do not know what this one is uh, I could tell the Czech one, that was the Prashna Brana from, uh, uh, from Prague, from the Karls Bridge. Uh, but this one, I'm not aware. I am not aware of what that is. But now, uh, <laughs> I am a bit worried that this might, this might uh, alarm him and he might try to stop me. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna stop him. So, I think, uh, whatever. Uh, what we can do, and we, what we should probably do, is just counter-attack. The best attack is defense. I mean the other way around, of course. Uh, <laughs> so, let's just build some trebuchets, and let's go slap some ass. And, yeah. Atakuime! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good, my guys. Oh, nope, not there. You want to slam this one. And this is the problem. This is what I was talking about. He just wants to focus the uh, the wonder, which I do not really want to allow. I would rather we focus on destroying him. So we will make some hussars here. That should defend this perfectly. And he's not even attacking anymore. Well, he has more pressing things at hand. Bam, 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 
Minus five. Minus. E. Let's go. <laughs> minus seven. This guy has like literally zero armor again. I don't know how much into into minus it can go, into negative. Uh, I imagine you can just nullify it. That's that's what I would think at least. Uh, but let's see. Let's see. Maybe we can. Yeah. Oh, minus minus one. Zero is the is the most it can go below two. So this does not stack indefinitely. But still, <laughs> this guy, elite outside wagon with zero armor. Ah, uh, that completely defeats the purpose of that unit. I think we have got that one in the back, so let's just put more units here onto the onto the wonder. Let's uh, protect the trebuchets a bit. Maybe we can make some more cavalry. You know, and slowly push in. I think this this castle deserves to be to be destroyed as well. He's been bothering me there for a bit. Uh, do, do, do. The winter stars are coming, coming. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Right. So, anything I'm forgetting about? We covered that. Oh yeah. Well, this is just a small bonus, of course. Uh, storm miners generate gold in addition to stone. That's interesting. That's interesting. I'm curious on why that is. What what kind of you know sparked the idea that that should be a thing, and how much uh, gold are we actually generating with that? Because I, I can't really I can't really notice. Uh, but uh, sure, not a bad thing. Every bonus is a good bonus. As that's what I'm saying. Uh, these guys feel very powerful just because of the unique units, honestly. Uh, unique units and the fall work sound very, very strong. The other, the other two, eh, I'm not sure about that. Uh, but the, the unique units, the unique technologies, I can see that being very, very strong already. And this guy is just chilling. Sigismund? Who the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. Well, he just came came here to <laughs> to check out the the wonder, but well, you're gonna get stabbed to death, to death, sir. And I think, yeah, this looks like a like a good good place to end it on. We're just gonna build some pretty places around it. Yeah, and just slowly push in. Don't think there's a reason to really stall this at all anymore. His economy is in shambles. Doesn't really have any army anymore. I'm killing everything that comes here. Great! I think I think that went great. We got to see everything that we wanted. The game wasn't too long. <laughs> uh, yeah, just a typical uh, placement for the wonder. I think this is <laughs> this is how it would look like in in real life as well. Okay, you can you can resign, my man. No reason. Yeah, perfect. So that was it. I hope you enjoyed checking the the polls. I think they're quite fun. Uh, we'll need to see about the balance, of course, but uh, nothing too outstanding. That would be, uh, that would seem too broken. They are strong, I agree on that, but let's see what the time brings. Until then, see ya!